Hi, this is a short video on how to use the snipping tool, um, which is a useful tool for capturing uh, images, uh, things from PDF files or websites, uh, and using the insert image feature right here to post that directly in the discussion window. Um, first thing you want to do is know how to find the snipping tool. It's pretty much a standard program that comes with Windows. Um, there's probably a similar version for uh, Macintosh users, uh, just go to your search bar, type in snipping tool, and there you have it. If you uh, want to use the snipping tool often, it might benefit you to pin it to your um, taskbar down below, which I've done. So there's the snipping tool instructions. Um, we're going to create a new snipping tool, but I want to go to the page that I'm going to be capturing first. Okay, so I'm going to click on New, and when I have my little crosshair or plus sign, um, I just left click on the upper left corner of the rectangle, drag, and lift, and there I have <coughs> the instructions that I now want to save. So I'm going to save this little snip. And I'll put it somewhere where I could find it. I've already done this. I've saved it as directions for 2.1 exercise 17. Okay, and there I have it. Yes, I do want to save it over. So now I can close that out. And I want to go back to where I was here. This is where I want to put the instructions for 17, exercise 17 from section 2.1. I'll use the insert image button, upload. I look for directions for 2.1, open that, add it. Now it wants to give me an alternate text. It doesn't matter what the title is, that never shows up. It's just a placeholder name and then hit update and there it is as an image and then once you're finished posting that you will see um, down below my silence, an old post, how to use the snipping tool to insert an image and there's your image let me know if you have any questions uh, the snipping tool can be used for a lot of different um, techniques and approaches, it's a really nice tool to have. I hope this video is helpful.